Our products go into the hands of those men and women that are out there protecting our freedom, and it's our job at East West to bring them home safely to their families. East West is an engineering manufacturing firm that produces aerospace life support and ground support equipment on military contracts, as well as in commercial markets too. We are a manufacturer of things like seats for helicopter and fixed wing applications. We do ejection seat subcomponents, oxygen systems, and ground support equipment. And we came to 3D printing because the model shop that we had, we had a dedicated machinist and dedicated machine. The line started getting very long, and the introduction of additive manufacturing allowed us to break that cycle of buy a new machine, then hire another machinist, or have that queue growing of parts you need to go manufacture, which affects delivery time. We believe the customer has to understand that East-West is a mini version of them. And then what part additive manufacturing plays is showing them how smart we are in making that supply chain shorten up so that we can reduce costs and reduce the time to get that product fielded. So the Fortis 450 does basically all of our parts with its large material capacity to run all weekend almost, so we can really crank out very large parts. The set it and forget it aspect of the 450 allows us to just run the parts. It's a seamless operation. We go home on Friday, hit print, come in a Monday, we have a lot of parts ready to evaluate. One of the ways that additive manufacturing has really been a huge benefit to East West is by allowing us to evaluate things early in the process and instead of waiting for machine parts that maybe tab their own lead times and, and costs associated with it, we can 3D print things very quickly. And then on the back end of things, as we go into the production stage, we've used these parts for inspection and then for assembly fixtures to accelerate things. If there is a department like inspection or assembly that needs something, they'll go right to engineering and kind of collaborate on how we can really develop something that can help them in their process. Our need to push the boundaries of part complexity, part consolidation, light weighting, our geometries have gotten very complex. And so being able to print the work holdings so that we can actually have lots of contact area without spending lots and lots of time machining it. Even the machinists often say, like, I could not machine this part the way you can print it. And that gives us a lot of flexibility to make sure that we can hold the parts well and get really high quality parts the first time. So after doing a really thorough evaluation, the business case for the Stratasys Ford is 450 made the most sense. And the Stratasys systems were a really great blend of both affordable price point, but also so the machines would be reliable and robust. You know, we had looked at much lower end systems and a lot of the feedback we were getting from actual users was they worked great the first time, but they worked less great over time. The Fortis 450 offered us from both a print size and a material capability was really significant. The machine has been really excellent from a, not just accuracy and reliability, but also repeatability. The machine is ready to go pretty much whenever we are. So it really has created a very high level of an ROI from a business standpoint.